Uh, it's Monday, um, which is a day after Sunday, but two days before right Wednesday, before Tuesday. and directly before Tuesday. It's you... disgusting, is what it is. Yes. Let me tell you about Monday. Let me tell you about Monday. First of all, Elena's not here because she had a trash work day. She had a hell of a week today at work. Uh, second of all, in like sad, disappointing, but minor inconveniences, my Surface Head bro phones are now broken. They are broken, broken. So I'm now in the market for new wireless headset. Try a little duct tape. You know, yeah, I I would, but you can't duct tape at that angle. It's not with like, that attitude. It's like a this weird little curve. I thought about um, super gluing it, but that's not going to work either. Uh, sounds like someone's not willing to try for their lord and savior, Microsoft. I mean, I could just buy another pair of Surface headphones. I mean, to be fair, he would always rather give them more money. That's true. I would like to give them more money, but I probably won't. Um, I am. I'm in the market for a new pair. Are of... they even making them anymore? Well, they make the two now. Oh. So they make Surface Headphone Two, and they make Surface Earbuds, which not about the earbud life. Um, I don't like that life either. Yeah, no, I want I want cans that fit over my ears like this. So I gotta find a nice like premium, like a studio I a nice quality. Cans for you. I bet you do. Yeah, I like your can, buddy. Um, so yeah. Um, it's your butt. It's it's his butt. That is his butt. In fact, yep. So yeah, that's what uh, that happened this afternoon. You know, while Lollipop wasn't at work with me again. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, you, 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 way, 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 all you want, buddy, all you want. Laugh it up, Bert. Um, Fine. Laugh it up, Fuzzball. Laugh it up, Fuzzball. Uh, okay, so I guess, yeah. Um, all right, so we've got, let's see, Wednesday's group therapy, Friday's fork knifing with the uh, with the llama. You see the llama in the background there now. Um, oh, is the llama gonna play? Yeah, the llama's probably gonna play with us. The llama will be our fourth. Um, Next Sunday, I'm playing Dragon Quest XI uh, that Elena redeemed on behalf of Matt Calder, which, by the way, by the way, um, so while I'm thinking about it, if you're not following Matt, um, Matt's fantastic. He's he's a he's a dear friend of mine from IRL, or I should say they. It, they go by either. Anyway, uh, Matt's a dear friend of mine from, from actual meat space. Uh, we used to work together oh, at a terrible <laughs> meet. We used to work together at a terrible company that all of us hate now. Um, and um, Matt's actually raising money over the next two weeks for to write love on her arms. And this is an organization actually based in Florida, and what they do is they help people who are struggling with uh, depression, addiction, and uh, suicide. Um, folks that are like either suicide survivors or struggling with suicide thoughts of suicide, etc. Uh, so Matt is raising money for them. Um, and if you could go give Matt a follow, and if you have the chance, please donate. Uh, it's it's a fantastic cause, uh, one that's very near and dear to Matt. But one of the stretch goals is if they get up to I think 750 bucks. Matt is being forced to play Fortnite with yours truly. So I have my own selfish reasons for for the goal to um that's the technical term anyway. Um, I, I am familiar with to write love on her arms and they uh, are legit. Quite legit. I'm going to make that face every 30 minutes too legit hidden to quit. <laughs> They are, they are too, what, I forget how to Final do point the, redemption to make that face? Yeah. I'm going to, Hidden, I'm going to make that face at you every half an hour. Tom, start the clock. 8-11. What do I look like? Fucking timekeeper? Yeah, you sure do, bud. Well, <laughs> boy, you're about to be disappointed. Yep. Um, so, but that's, uh, that's about it. That's the biggest stuff, so... Tonight, we're going to get back into some more main story quests. There's an event going on that Lollipop knows everything about and I know absolutely jack shit about. Uh, so I think at this point, it's really just... It's, it's, it's time to do some tiny horsing. So let's just... Let's fucking do it.
Yeah, quit tiny horsing around and get in here. <laughs> All right, that's fair. Start large horsing around. Large horsing. Tiny horse. Tiny horse. It's very important. I have begun the seasonal event. You're a seasonal event. Probably. That's hurtful. I mean, I don't I don't know that it is. I'm pretty sure that's not hurtful at all. In fact, I think that might be a compliment. So you want to be a pugilist? So you want to be a pugilist? Mm -hmm. I'd say you want to be a punch cat, but you're not a cat. I just have that uh, quest on my map. The truth Wait. does hurt hidden, especially when the truth is in a book that someone hits you with. Mm. You know that happens around here. We have we have yeah. book related violence occasionally. That happened to me. Mm. But that's a story for another day. That is a story for another day. You might Whoops. say that it's it, it'll be stored in a storybook one day. No. But it's a really long story. We're not going to go there today. What, uh... Mamadi. Mamadi. What's Mamadi. going on here? There's a quest, like, right at the... Wait, oh, you're at the Ass Castle. I am at the Ass Castle. Yeah, it's come to Old Da. It's extremely crystal -y. Uh Uh-huh. Or crystalline, as it were. Alright, uh... Where do I go? Olda? Olda. Yep. Yeah. Okay. Then come out and hang the left and you'll see where you're supposed to be. Okay, we're, we aren't going to talk about it today. Okay. But... Okay, now where do I go? Uh, you'll hang a left. You'll, you're looking for a quest giver that's a cat girl. Oh, a cat girl, huh? Mm-hmm. Yeah, your specialty. Is it my specialty? Ooh, seems like it. Let's see. This quest is available for a limited time only. Red That's Moon Parasol. Man, it's an umbrella and it's a moon. Perfect to shield you from rain or sun. That's true. That's true, kid. Oh. The alchemists. Killed. I don't know, Hidden. I know. Hidden, what the fuck are you on about? Hello, Meow Meow. I am an adventurer. Oh my god. Let's see. It's, it's alright. I got this. Don't worry about it. Oh yeah. I got it. It's fine. Don't worry about it. That's one for you today, Hidden. Congratulations on getting the first loot of the day. <laughs> but it certainly won't be the last. For Hidden or otherwise. I'm sure. That's true. Hidden and her, her ducks. Quack, quack, quack. Quack. No, go away. <laughs> Gooey! I don't want to click on you. I want to click on this thing. Seasonal event quest accepted. Let's see. All right, let's do it. Um. Okay, I gotta go. Oh yeah, you didn't. You didn't start in Old Oz, so you've never been to Old Oz, or you don't go to Old Oz Adventurers Guild regularly, do you? I mean, it, there's been a shit ton of. The uh, MSQ's going on through here, so. Hey, buddy. What a. 
Would a popato prostitute be a tiny whore? Yes. Okay. Technically, but we don't talk about it because they look like children. Also, yes. All right, I'm just just making sure we're clear on everything here. <laughs> Technically, according according to the lore, you are correct. But also, let's not. Out of line. <laughs> <laughs> Whistles innocently. La 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 Bye. Ooh, great. Where's that? The Alchemist Guild? No. Oh. No, I've already been there. Oh. I'm doing a different one. Just... I'm like one step ahead where you are. <laughs> or I guess two, maybe. Ah, I see. Hello, Keepy Jackia. <laughs> Hello, Jerry. Hello, Newman. Keith Hernandez spit on them. Yeah. Nice goggles, fuck waffle. Oh yeah, I guess I should... <laughs> I guess I could have just gone straight there, but you know, that's fine. Whatever, I did it. New. I don't Whatever, I do what bye I Tom, want. Bye, Tom. Bye, Tom. Okay, see ya. I'm in a cutscene. Ooh. You see, Where that's you a scene that they cut away from the main action to display to you. I thought it was just a scene where he gets cut a lot. No, that's that's a... That's a get cut scene, I think? I don't know. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I didn't say. It was under that said it. I didn't say shit. Bro, I wasn't even in town that weekend. <laughs> but it was five minutes ago. It wasn't the weekend. And yes, you were. <laughs> and you can't say Pixar didn't happen because we're on a stream. There's a bot of it. <laughs> You know, at the end of this, if she doesn't Chopped. say thanks for helping me out, I'm going to be really upset. <laughs> well, you better be gird your loins, my friend, because you're probably going to be disappointed. You know, they might be cat girls, but they don't actually really do a lot of the cat side of that. She's a fucking cat! She better say the line! It's really, it's just cosmetic surgery. I have yet to see a uh, Emma Cote knock anything off of a table. Have you seen them, like, lick their arms to bathe? Uh, maybe. I know... Maybe? I love that there's a maybe. I know that male Makote have the, like, the sit. Like, they actually sit down like that. Like a cat. What, with, like, their their arms in front of them? Yeah. Hmm. <laughs> Look, there's my Pokedex at my side. It's to help me identify Pokemon happened, in the wild. But this cutscene, for some reason, has, uh, like, Love Boat esque music going on. Yeah, it. yeah, I can feel it. Hmm. 
the love boat. Oh, oh, it's a cat dude. Bye, cat dude. Alone in the world is a little cat dude. What's the fastest way to get there? Oh, I have to just go in there anyway. Oh, aren't you adorable? Well, thank you. So, do you two know this backstory about what happened in 1.0 and how they transitioned everything over? Not I'm really. sure I've told you about it, but uh, I'm, do you, do you want to know about it? Because it's kind of what this whole event is about. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, well, mm -hmm. I mean, we need something to fill the time, so you might as well. So, it, 1.0 was just a giant dumpster fire, right? So the game was just awful. They fired everyone, hired Yoshi P, brought in a whole new staff, unfucked the game, apologized for. They did all of that, right? And storyline-wise, the seventh Umbral Calamity, when they talk about that, that was um, Bahamut getting out and fucking everything up. They literally... For 2.0, they they did a calamity to reset the game. So, and... so 1.0 was actually the calamity. <laughs> That's the real calamity yeah. all along. 1.0 1, 1 was the calamity we made along the way, yes. <laughs> and so in that's that's why 2.0 is called a realm reborn because there was literally a calamity in the game that they did to um, shut down the servers and do all of that. And this event celebrates the anniversary of that. And I say celebrates as in like for us, the players, it's a celebration <laughs> of the anniversary of Realm Reborn. In game, it's sort of a memorial of the calamity. You know, that reminds me a lot of The Matrix Online when it finally got shut down. Um, so, I'm, I'm sure you're familiar with the, the basic story of The Matrix. It's the future, machines have taken over, enslaved humanity, plugged them into this massive computer simulation, blah blah blah. Okay, so The Matrix Online picks up after the third movie leaves off, where humans are free to do what they want. Um, and the Matrix still exists. There are people still plugged in, but you can go in. You are a free person, a free human, who can go and come and go into the Matrix as you please. Which, really, the game only exists inside the Matrix. So, like, basically, if you're not jacked into the Matrix, you're on the fucking main menu. Um, hidden... Get the fuck out. Oh, Just... that's not nice. No, that one. No, hidden was not nice. Get out. Just stop. She's still plugged into the stop matrix. It. You see? Yeah, I know. Have you actually never seen it hidden, like any of them, at all? Well, you're like you're like nineteen anyway, so it's fine. Um. So, anyway, um, you're. <laughs> I I said what I said. Um, so, you, you basically, you know, you're a human doing your thing in the Matrix, but, um, you end up, like, at the end of the, the, the game, they had all these things that happened, all these events, the storyline and everything, and at the end, like, the whole thing got shut down. Like, basically, the machines gave in to humanity, they decided to unplug everyone, and they were, like unplugging the matrix as we knew it so leading up to the end of the matrix online instead of everything being green tinted like the whole sky turned red and like it was had this like weird stormy haze over it and at the very end they unplugged everyone and i mean this in a matrix sense where in like the matrix where you if you unplug someone who's still currently connected they die that's what happened. So, like, you're standing around, 
And as the different servers are getting unplugged and like different people are dropping off, you're watching people around you, like the server instances, they're getting shut off. People are just like, characters are just falling down dead. They're literally unplugging the different players in like batches to shut down the server. So people are just like, they're just player corpses everywhere. And then eventually it gets to you and it's like your connection is lost, like the, the connection severed and that's it. That's the end of the whole fucking game. It's mm -hmm. just out. Mm -hmm. It was like, it was dramatic, but it was pretty amazing. Hidden, get, get, god damn it, Hidden. <laughs> you know what, Hidden? You know what? You know what? This is why G eats all your fucking cream cheese. That right there. That's why he eats your fucking cream cheese and drinks your orange juice. Oh, I thought you were going to give her a yikes. No, she doesn't. Oh, you know what? No. Fuck you. You know, she, yeah. You get, you also... Hidden gets a yikes. Yeah, that's right. Hidden has been awarded one yike. I will not take it back. I a will not. And a lewd. Yeah, that's right. You know, it's one thing to be lewd, but then you were then you had to be yikes. I am offended, madam. I am offended. I am I am wounded. In the words of Fraser Crane. Oh. I can't tell you what, but oh. Okay. You'll see in a few minutes. Okay. Oh, you'll see right the fuck now, actually. Oh. Whoa, yes, it's I a kinda... thing. I feel like this is going to be a very cool cutscene. Ooh, am I talking to the crystal? You is, wish. Is it crystal mommy? So rude, Hidden. So rude. You know, if I'm going to take this kind of abuse from you, Hidden, I might as well just fucking make you a mod. <laughs> Greetings, Warrior of Light. Hello, mystery person in armor. Stop. Hammer time. Stop. Drop and roll. Hold on a second. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay, now listen. Now listen. Okay, it is one thing. It is one thing to have influence and put, like, your fingerprint on a game. It is another thing. Entirely to just say fuck it, I'm in the game now. <laughs> a thousand the, uh, points to Yoshi P. The the wandering minstrel is supposed to be him as well. Oh my god, this is this is phenomenal. This victory we owe to those who persevered alongside us, to those who explored and nurtured and loved this realm as much as we. <laughs> Translated, the 1.0 people who are still actually fucking here. <laughs> There's a lot of them, actually. <laughs> oh, I, I, yeah. I remember seeing those credits, and then the credits after the credits. Listen, if you stuck around for 1.0, this game has only gotten better since then <laughs> i can only imagine i mean it's it's really good now so like all the horror stories about 1.0 like this is why people come back to it because they've taken the time to make it better see also no man's sky see also no man's sky oh what oh nice. more stuff uh nothing like that just Nice. Okay. Nice. nice. Yeah. All right. Quest Rest complete. well, 
Warrior of Light for a grand convergence of events approaches. Oh! May the road upon which you have, must embark become the greatest of all journeys. I unlocked a mini game. And I got a Chivo? Until we meet again, what my friend. Day. Thanks, Yoshi P. Your armor's really cool, by the way. I hope I can get some. That is the um, Paladin class gear for Endwalker. Uh, so yes, if you if you level Paladin, you will eventually be able to get that armor. All right. Oh, oh, I can see the I can see it in the hair now. Mm -hmm. Like looking at the hair, now that you've said it, just looking at the hair. Yeah, that's that's him. Especially if you go look up what he looks like, like yes, he always has that messed up hair. It's yeah, I was about to say like just looking at the hair and the color and everything. I'm like, yeah, that's Yoshi P. Okay, that makes sense. A great many lives were lost in the flames of the calamity. Not to mention the chaos which followed. <laughs> Translation, the fucking dev team that I had to rally. <laughs> uh, Time to buy more Heaven's Crackers. I only get to buy these once a year. What do you do with them? You eat them. They're crackers. You, you use them. Oh. Wait, what do I get for this? Oh, I get stuff? Boom booms! Look at the boom booms! Look at all the pretty boom booms. Those are so pretty boom booms. doing with the uh, with your sub this month Tom oh I'm putting together a fucking jigsaw puzzle <laughs> seems legit look at all them boom booms that's pretty boom, boom. oh 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 it did the thing it did the, it thing. Did the thing did you see it did you see it do the thing it yeah. did the thing that's why I said earlier Hey, hey, why is why is the game in the game? That's the event. All of the seasonal events have a have a logo on their on their quest. Oh, Where, any, almost anywhere. The thing. You've unlocked it. Oh yay! I have the puzzle now. Yay! Yeah, I'm doing it. Are you? Did you do it yet? And is it done? I'm it is not done. No. Okay, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go do it. I'm gonna go make the attempt. Welp. Still, still working on my edges, you know. Working on edging. Uh, lewd? You're gonna get a lewd for that. Yeah. Yeah, I think. I think. Actually, hold on. I have a. Uh, there yes, we go. Push the button. Yes, yeah, I got the. You. I got the button. Don't worry. Be <laughs> hidden. I told you you wouldn't be the only one. Yeah. No. No. It's fine. Dude. Yeah, I, I I'm gonna end up having like a whole fucking section of buttons just for lewds. You're gonna have to get another stream deck. <laughs> Say he's gonna uh, buy a stream deck just. I'm gonna to buy I'm gonna buy a little stream deck with the 15 buttons just for fucking lewd, lewd and yikes. This is what you've created. Th Listen, you, you know brought. what? <laughs> this is I've met with a terrible fate. This is. This is how Izzy loses his first place ranking on the on the lewd ranks. That's that's a good point, yeah. <laughs> Hidden, I, Hidden and I are just going to be in a constant struggle are you, to, are you guys to out loot each other. We're having a loot off. <laughs> <laughs> it wouldn't even be the most upsetting thing that's ever happened on this stream, so <laughs> Oh, fuck off. That goes there. We both know it. I 
Bowser. How you doing, bud? Pieces make a satisfying snap noise when you actually get them in the right spot. Yeah, I'm trying to find the other corners. Snap you in the right spot. <laughs> this is what we're doing now. You know what I really Somebody need to do? Contest. You know what I, I really need to do? I need to have like a little thing that pops up. Like a little thing, like like the, the, the little lewd well, sign that pops pop up. one of those? Oh. Oh. Oh, like that, you mean. <laughs> uh. Aww. I have not yet begun to loot. Like that guy in uh, Mortal Kombat that would pop out of the bottom corner and, and uh, whoopsie. say whoopsie. whoopsie. Yeah. <laughs> Instead of saying that, he just says loot. Lootsy. <laughs> yeah, all right. I'm sure, what the fuck ever. Because content, listen, <laughs> it's fucking, it's Monday night, I'm doing a puzzle. I am also doing a puzzle. It's very relaxing. I'm fishing. That's also relaxing. You know how I love my fishing. Boy, howdy, you do love you some fishing, let me tell you. Wouldn't, I won't, won't ever catch me doing it in real life, but. Well, in your defense, that is a lot of work. And also, it's a, lot in, of, it's a lot of disgusting, smelly work. Is what the problem is. It's and it's extremely outside, which you are oh. notoriously not about. Oh, I'm again it. Oh, well, no, hold on a second. Really? That? Oh, okay. You're a right. Sprightly young puzzle piece fellow. No. Nope. Mm -mm. Yeah. What's uh? What you? No, I don't want that one. What's uh? What's G doing tonight? Hidden. What's he up to? You doing G stuff? Just G things? You know, I've never played God of War. I mean, I've never had, you know, owned a PlayStation, yeah. so... I was going to say, you can't play God of War. You refuse to purchase the necessary hardware. It's not that I refuse. It's just that, like, I have every All of my gaming needs are met between PC and Xbox, so it's like, there's nothing on PlayStation that, like, is, like, incredibly compelling to me to buy it. So it's like, you know, besides, there's not enough of them and all that, so just let everybody else buy them. But I hear really good things about God of War, mostly from Tom. From me? Yeah, haven't you played God of War? No. I thought you did. No. Huh. I, I, I tried it for a few minutes, but never enough to talk about. Like, it's very difficult. Well, then what am I thinking of that you talked about with me? How the fuck am I supposed to know? I say many things. I don't remember. The, the latest God of War is also vastly different from the other God of War games. He's bringing you... He's bringing you Sherbert? Wait, what flavor of Sherbert? This is an important question. Rainbow? All right, all right. That's... Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. That's a good choice. Yeah, I mean, if you're going to do it, you know... Who'd him like some rainbow sherbs? Mm hmm. Alright, let's see. So it's gotta be a piece. Like that. You said piece. I can't argue with you, I did. It's not what I heard. Apple, but okay. fruit punch, and cherry? I, I could probably be down for. I'm not mo like. I'm not usually one for like fruit flavored frozen confections like that. Like if I'm gonna have something that's ice cream adjacent, I'm just gonna get fucking ice cream, and something that's either creamy, chocolatey, both, whatever. Mm. I like orange sherbet. Yeah, orange sherbet's good too. Yeah. I think my uh my opinion on sherbet is kind of uh probably mis 
guided because of the having to eat it with that stupid wooden spoon thing when you were in school. Oh, I loved eating with the wooden spoon thing. I hate those things. I clearly didn't have this experience you're describing. Do you not remember the little plastic cups with like the little wooden scoop thingy? Hold on, I'll find it. Mm -mm. All right, let's find a picture of the disposable ice cream cup thingy. Maybe it was a texture thing, but I never liked that. But I'm also a picky ass eater, so you are a you picky know. ass eater. But like <laughs> this, Tom, <laughs> this is ass eater. This is the thing that he's talking about. So like the little cups with like the little wooden paddle thing that you would eat eat it with. Oh, I remember the cups. I didn't have a wooden paddle. Really? You never had one of those? <laughs> uh uh Fuck. Do I do I say that's a paddling? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Hidden. God damn it, hidden! I'm not even doing it. I'm not even. I'm not even dignifying it with a response. To be fair, if if someone's getting a loot out of that, it's me, because I'm the one that said it. Yeah, I mean that's true. That's. I'm yeah. just making sure that the appropriate loot point gets awarded. If this is a competition between hidden and I. I don't think it's a competition. It's not a competition, Pam. I don't know. Someone gets a loot there. <laughs> Bitch, it might. <laughs> like, in the interest of the competition that exists, <sighs> fine. Someone deserves a loot. Fine, fine. There, get have 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 your loot and eat it too. Well, now you're just splitting hairs, hidden. Ass hairs, maybe. Oh, ugh, ugh. that's. <laughs> You don't have to loot that one. That's that's perfectly reasonable Yay. to loot that one. I did it. I don't get anything for this, do I? No. <laughs> the pleasure of doing a puzzle. Correct. Yeah, yeah. And the, and the puzzle's think... just a puzzle. Enjoy it. That's fine. I, th I think I am also the 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 leader on the yikes board right now. Yeah, I think you are too. It's because I awarded you one yike, you see. You did, and then you got a big yikes for that. Mm -hmm. I feel like this should go like here-ish, Some, somewhere near near there. I don't fucking know. This is so weird to play like on screen. Why can't I put anything in the armor? The armor uh, only has spe only lets you have specific things in it. The storage in it is unlimited, but they predetermine what can go into it. It's usually um, the older, like a realm reborn class sets that you get from like your quests. And um, some seasonal stuff goes in there, and then you get veteran rewards for consecutive months or con yeah months. Yeah, subscribe. In those veteran rewards can go in the armor. Don't worry, hidden. You'll you you'll get plenty. I I have faith in you. If you have things that can go in the armor, put them there because it's it's. It's free real estate. It's free. Right. It's free real estate. I was gonna say it. God damn it! <laughs> uh, you can fly no higher, except for this higher part where it can fly. Uh, it's free real estate. <laughs> he said the thing. He said the thing. <laughs> hey, look, it's a fate that I have to join. <laughs> Contractually obligated to join. I am obligated by this quest. By law. By the law of that quest. Quest law, you see. It's quest law. It's like cat law. You can't disobey it. And... I know, bud. Uh, give me ten seconds before my buff runs out, and then I will let you out. 
Oh, I didn't even get a can I? Should I do the thing since since Elena's not here? Hmm. Chris, you have a dog. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> it's not wrong. Hey, you guys, fuck off! You're not part of the fate. Get out of here. Yeah, get out of here, you fateless fuck. I told him for you, Tom. Smelly pricks with your legs and your faces. Oh my god, I hate when they have legs and faces. Jesus Christ, that's the worst. Oh, someone else is doing this fate as well. Fantastic. Do they also have legs and faces? Yes, but they have helpful legs and faces. Oh, well that's good. Yay! Oh. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Show the curious parchment. I don't remember fucking any of this. I did it. Mm. Oh, yeah, nicely done. Thanks. Yes, I would like to put the puzzle away. I love that it asks you if you would like to put the puzzle away as if, like, no, I don't think I will. Java Minecraft is my first love, in fact. Oh, yeah, I have a. Uh, I have. A couple of uh, dungeons to do. At some point. You. Yeah. Um. To the surprise yeah. of no one. After Zundeperon gets here. Yeah. All right. Well. Uh, I will just be here, fishing my fish. Whenever you need me. Hmm. Y'all and you're fishing. Hidden, you, uh, you mean like one of these? Yeah, I wish I had that too. Yeah, he wishes he had the controller support for, for that one. I got, the, there's like the one mod that does it, but it doesn't, it's, it's... Uh, man, I might, I might, I might update the mod. And I will hate myself because I will spend like weeks doing it just to play it like three times and be like, no, I miss Bedrock. Especially because that means you're also going to have to do it in Java. In, in my defense, Hidden, I refuse to play with anyone right now. <laughs> yeah, we're, we're, we're... I'm burnt all the way out on Minecraft. Yeah, and... Nobody else really wants to play, so we're all just kind of like... I'm probably uh, mo moving into Breath of the Waifu territory now that I have affected the masses. Oh, so you're going to be going full hard on Genshin, huh? Probably. I mean, I will probably go full hard on getting my relic weapon done, but when I need a break from that, I will go hard on Genshin, probably. That's fair. The speedruns are great, but they're also like... I have to actually think what I'm doing them, because the whole point is to go fast, so... You gotta go fast. You gotta go fast. Well spoken. And, and realistically, going fast just means that there's a bunch of these zone-specific buffs, and if you just stack the crap out of them as a group, you can get done with the whole... What's normally like a 45-minute instance, you can get it down under 15. Yeah.
and it's like obnoxious bonuses too. Like white mages can, have, for no mana, they can basically increase all of the damage they do by upwards of like uh, I want to say 180, 190 percent. Upwards of like dollars. Yes, and it's it's at the cost of completely not being able to do any healing or take any healing. So you you basically have to just do damage during that window to do anything worthwhile. Now you're just trying too hard, hidden. I mean, I'm I'm giving it to you, but now you're just trying too hard. But no, hidden, it, like, the whole thing is... Is it going is, too hard to... Oh, go ahead. I was just going to say, no, like, the whole thing is just... I I really like my controller. Control ends. Eh, that's all. Okay, sorry. Oh, I was going to say, is it... Is it trying too hard for her if, if she's... Uh... I don't know. If she's oh, I was gonna say, is, is it going too hard if she's threatening you with a good time? I mean, it could be. It could be like. It could be like, um. Uh, let's see. How do I put this? I don't know. I don't know how to word, so I'm done. I got nothing. But potentially, yes, is the answer. <laughs> Almost done with my fishing relic. And then it's just combat relics and I'm done. Done. Dunzies, Dunzo. Oh. If I stand here long enough, does it do the thing? I'm gonna find out. I'll give it a minute. I don't think it does. Dang. The airship landing? I don't want to fucking go to the airship landing. Ugh. Here you do. Who wouldn't? Me. I just said Not it. airships. Airships love going there. They love landing there, specifically. Airships don't really have much of a choice because there is no other airship landing. They only have the airship landing. There's not an alternate airship landing, so, you know. Do they get moved to the airship takeoff after that? Yeah, it's like a runway, but for airships. Oh. Yeah. Look at the ass castle. Wanna get back to to ass place, Asberg. I hear Assians live there. Yeah. Yeah. I, no, I they're ass guardians. Of the galaxy. <laughs> Lol. I somehow have stumbled upon the Hildebrand quests. Probably because those start in Uldah, and you were just in Uldah. No, I had this in my list. Just accepting shit left and right, you know? Mm-hmm. Hmm. Build-a-bear? I... Yes, I'm a Build-a-bear. And someone just threw me together from miscellaneous shit in the, in the trash bin at the Build-a-bear. And that's how you get me. That sounds like, uh... When a mama bear and a father bear love each other very much. Or at least for five minutes or so. I was gonna say, uh, one of, one of 
one of the segments Stephen Colbert has on the Late Show, uh, calls it Meanwhile, which is just a bunch of like random ass news that he just finds, but like he introduces it in some like he calls his monologue some kind of fine piece of artwork however he wants to describe it be it like a painting or a, p a piece of food and how he cooked it and everything and then he takes meanwhile and he equates it to like how he rummaged through the trash for all of these crappy pieces of paper that he uh, put together with like glue taken from a child that he was that was about to eat it or some shit like that like he just he does it a lot of justice because obviously he's a comedian, but it, it is hilarious. Like, it's one of my favorite things that I don't even like care about what the rest of the segment is. I love that he how he comes up with those. And they've just gotten more complex as he goes along. You you lost me. My bad. I, I am lost. I mean, that's not hard to do, bud. Who said that? Yeah, that's yeah. Yep. Me just over here in Rivendell. I'm sorry, Gridania will always be Rivendell. Like, it's just... Wait, I really understand why Elena hates this guy. Is it a spoiler guy? It's Hildebrand. Oh, oh, Hildebrand. I don't know. I think he's all right. Triple Triad Challenge. Let's fucking go, nerd. Same dissension and plus. I don't know what any of those mean. When a card's played, a two more slots. Oh, Jesus. A card's ranks decrease in proportion to the number of cards of the same type already played. Uh, and you know what? I don't know what any of that means. There oh, is a I mountain don't want to assist him with the investigation. There, there is a mount tied to getting every triple triad card in the game. Oh. Of course there is. Guess what it is. Uh, is it a card? It's a giant triple triad card, yes, and you can ride on it. Of course the fuck it's you the can. It's the most Yu-Gi-Oh shit ever. <laughs> of course the fuck you can. Oh my god, did I win? It's oh my god, I won. I won. Nope. I'm leaving now. You have a little star over your head. That's all that matters. It means you did the thing. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Oh. Don't forget to use the parasol. Oh, no, that's a faded copy. I got all these faded copies. I'm not sure how to play this. Level 90 weapon coffer. Fashion accessories. Are you trying to play Tom? Oh, a triple triad. Did you know you can play Mahjong in Final Fantasy XIV? Mm -hmm. Yeah, but like... I except I don't know how to play that either, so it doesn't help me much. Yeah, I have no idea how to play it competitively. I know how to play it against myself. Barely. I'm pretty sure that's what you end up doing. I think that's one of the things I 
appreciate about this game is like for an MMO I, I, there's just stuff here for the sake of stuff being here yeah like basically everything in the golden saucer is here just for the sake of being here like it doesn't serve any purpose except to just get miscellaneous shit that never has any bearing on the story whatsoever mm-hmm Oh, I won. Oh, many compilations, Elizagirth. But all I got was money. Which reminds me, um, boy, that person that tweeted that today really uh, was out for violence, weren't they, Tom? Oh, man. Fucking bitches. 20 fucking years. Can you believe that? 20 years since home, since the first strong bad email on Homestar Runner. HomestarRunner.net. It's dot com. Hurtful. It was hurtful. It was, it was it was rude is what it was. Rude. I went again. Oh, I'm a real try. boy. Give me that card. What it is. What it be. Who dare? Who dare? Probably not a Corbin. Probably. Oh, no. What? I forgot the cardinal rule of these freaking relics. What's that? Something about you birds, need, probably. Mm. In a lot in a lot of the instances, you need to have the tool or weapon or whatever you're trying to make the relic out of. You need to have it equipped in order to do whatever quest you need to do. But then you have to be the job to turn it in, but then you also have to have the relic in your inventory so you have to have a if you re, if that is the only tool for that job that you have you have to go get another tool from somewhere else and equip it just long enough to turn in the quest and that sounds like a lot of work it usually like for my weapons it hasn't been a problem because up until i actually finish the relic it's not better than any of the tools that i currently or any of the weapons that i currently have but for my fishing relic specifically that's not the case so i have to go fucking buy a fishing rod from somewhere well see tom it didn't have anything to do with birds at all i thought it was going to be something like you know papal or something it's a and terrible cardinal rule cardinal your rule is, wait, is, is Cardinal Rule what happens when, like, they decide not to have a Pope, but, like, run by committee? Is that is that how that works? Probably. You know, I don't know how that works. I don't know that they know how that works. I, the whole thing's made up anyway. And the points don't matter. That's right. <laughs> I just grabbed a... Whose Pope is it anyway? L I just grabbed a level 8 fishing rod off the market board for like 180 gil. I mean, whatever. <laughs> Hell, I got... You want a fishing rod? I can get you a fishing rod. I got like seven. No, I only have like two. I got it. I got it. I got it. We, good. we Gucci, as the kids say. Do the kids say that what? still? I don't... Yeah, I never got a clear answer on that. Hi, fat chicken. Hi, fat say... chicken. D didn't you say Hidden's 19 or something? Like, she can answer that question, right? Hidden says no. Hidden says they do not say that anymore. Ah, uh, okay. Good. Hidden, Hidden. She, she is the lady. She's the leading expert on that. She so. she works with the children's now, you see. She's she's one of the Utes. Or she works with the Utes. It can, it, listen, a little column A, a little column B. Aha. Uh -huh. Oh, yeah. damn it. I got the same card. She right. do be trying to teach them. She's trying to. She she do be trying to learn him a thing or two. I want the other one. Huh. The Colonel. 
This guy has two cards you could win from him, but I don't, I keep winning the wrong one. Just have to kick his ass more. That's true. Oh, I can't use this anymore because the Moonfire Fair is over. Dang. Womp, and I can't stress this enough. Womp. Yeah, I don't know what... I don't, I don't really care because... What the Damn hell it. am I going to use him for? But still... I don't even know what I'm supposed to do with extra cards. Take him to the gold saucer. There is a vendor... Um... Who will exchange them for you. Yeah, I will actually just go there and link it to you. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. That way you get additional MGP. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Which then you guys can save up so that you can buy a car later. Beep, beep. You yeah, know, when is that? Fancy car is the only way to uh, fly. It, it's either next month or... Yeah, it's, I think it's got to be next month. There you go, Tom. I got you. Oh. I can see it, but I'm in a a match. I can't do anything with it. Dun, That's dun, fine. Dun, 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 dun. And my job here is done. But you didn't is do it? anything. <laughs> Whoosh. I might make a uh, I might make a channel point redemption for wearing a robe for like ten minutes or something. Been thinking about that one. And your pirate hat. Maybe the pirate hat. The pirate hat's a lot harder to do logistically because of the headphones, you see. Mm. Ooh, I got a Chibo. <laughs> and 5,000 more? MGP. No, no. It's, they're only Chivos if they come from the Xbox region of France. Otherwise, they're just sparkling advancements. Your face is a sparkling advancement. Um, sparkling advance your face? I got a poop. You got a poop? What? Did you say you got a poop? Who said that? How was that lewd? Sparkle on his face. What a. Oh, <laughs> Come on. <laughs> bold endeavor. Listen, I have I have dial I have voiceover dialogue. Blue, I'm blue. Dabba dee dabba die. Oh, and I got the card. Yay! Organization would pay Fuck you, buddy. For You're a loser. I whipped your well, ass. Do I understand his impatience? Since facing the common threat of the Ultima weapon, our nations have seemed farther apart, not closer together. Considering the many problems we face, <laughs> should we not be glad that someone else is taking the initiative? We have all pledged I got a Loralito Nanarito. I don't know what that means. Well, that's the name of the card I got. Alright, well that sounds fancy then. I myself have doubts as to the good this organization will achieve. Listen to the Popito. Small Popito. With the infusion of the finest soldiers of the three grand companies, it promises to be a fearsome military body. But whom will it serve? Even under the watchful gaze of the Scions. It is not unthinkable that such a force could perpetrate a great wrong. I wish then Defron was here. He'd, he'd be all nostalgic. Does it not concern you that a significant proportion of its financial backing came from the coffers of the Syndicate? <gasps> Hi, Vivian! Worms might forge Triple Triad, traitor. Well, I'll be goddamned. You goddamned. will be goddamned. I have trust in the Scions, Your Grace. They have I have 200,000. No the hands of the primals. MGPs. If they seek reinforcements, I deem it unwise to deny them. 
Viv, Likewise. have you re- have you recovered from your extensive walking earlier, bud? How you feeling? I haven't yeah, walked that much in a year. Yeah, I bet you are sleepy. Holy shit. As for their finances, full many gave generously. And though our nobles proffered a sizable sum, their coin did not spill from the pockets of Lolorito and his cronies. And what of the presence of our stalwart adventurer friend in this endeavor? Hey, that's me. I doubt the warrior of light would betray our cause. No, I can't. It, like, the story literally won't let me do that giant guy, so don't worry about that. I don't think I have Unless a thought it does. About it. Unless it does, and you just don't know it. Spoilers! That is several miles, Viv. I haven't walked that much since, like, 2007. Last time you were at Disney. Hmm. I don't walk that much at Disney. Fuck that. Whether we will or no, the events of the age hurl us this way and that, like a dust devil skipping across the sands. Hello, yellow moon. Cannot be done about Oh, don't talk to her. She's mean. I have explored all avenues available to us, Your Grace. I got an email from AARP. now stands. We lack the evidence to convict him of any crime. To arrest ah. him on spurious grounds would only play Big into goes like Batman. Green potato. Committed treason. Your face is treason. <laughs> Nailed her. Yeah, you got her good. Oh. Oh, woe is me! But everything went well, right, Viv? Like you're you, like you're you're the wheels are in motion, so to speak. <laughs> because it was for 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 drivings. Oh look, look, sad that girl's name is Bacon Bits. Sad. Oh, that's that's great. Sad Popato though. Have faith. She was just angry, Popato. She let the rage out. She did. Sometimes the rage. Now she said, Popato. Sometimes the rage comes out of your face holes. Uh, one of you. Viv, I am so 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 excited for you, buddy. Like I I I'm. This I'm I cannot wait for. Your, yeah. For life to continue progressing in in good directions. Boomst among you dares challenge me. <laughs> no. Tom's like, who the fuck are you? <laughs> Whomst the fuck? Where is this dildo? Okay, he's over there now. Yeah, you listen. You'll get it this time. You'll actually finish up. You'll get it. You'll be fine. It'll be great. And once you do, then you know, you'll be able to do your thing. Oh my god, look, look, it's it's fucking It's fucking Yoshi P. That son of a bitch. Then he can work at Costco. You down with Yoshi P? Uh, yeah, you know me. Welcome to Costco. I love you. <laughs> Welcome to Costco. I love you. Hashtag Costco buddies. I mean, frankly, though, like, lot, lot worse places you could work than Costco. I know, like, it's, it, it's... I've worked at some of them. Y you have. You, you, you did your time in the, in the retail food circuit. Where the hell is he? Pray return to the Waking Sands. I don't. I don't even know what a non means. Well, maybe you'll find out if you return to the waking sands. I can't. The waking sands are sleeping forever now. Oh. They're the sleepy snows the now. The sleeping sands. More donuts. 
Holy shit, I would love a donut right now. Oh my god, you know what I want? I want a fucking... I want a fucking Krispy Kreme, um, like, cream-filled donut. Chocolate glazed on top? That's what the fuck I want. You know, I just would like a regular-ass plain glazed donut. Just a classic. Glaze oh. your donut. I... <sighs> Yeah. Yeah. That that one was strictly in the name of the sport. No, I know. I know it was. I know it was. Listen, y he set it up, you had to knock it down. I mean, honestly, Viv, like, after the exhausting day that you've had... Uh, who could blame you? Frankly. Hearing like this music, this is like I just I think about six where they have the uh, like like you're about to go on a fucking mission like shit's about to get real you know. Whole vibe from Rising Stones or Rising that that not more Dona just in general. I feel like. Zoop. Gotta zoop it out real good, you know. Zoop, zoop, mm -hmm. zoop, zoop. Lots of zooping going on. So much zooping. Holy shit, the zoops. Oh, Tom, what was it in, uh... Damn it. What were the three things like the bleeps, the something, and the creeps? I forget oh, what bleeps, it was. The sweeps and the creeps? The bleeps, the sweeps, and the creeps. That's what it is. Oh, yeah. That's it. It's not all he's lost. The incident with the new frontier Ooh. hands? No, no. You need not elaborate. I have been following their progress with no small amount of interest. Brave men and women all. They do our nation a great service. The existence of a fortified outpost in Mordona. Mordona. Do much to dissuade the Empire from trespassing on Curthis soil. Right glad am I that you have chosen to lend your support to this endeavor. Never let it be said that House Fort Tom does not acknowledge the efforts of her allies. Or oh, oh. Fort Tom. <laughs> oui. Twas in the spirit of gratitude that I arranged for sundry supplies to be delivered to Revenant's toll. That the shipment should chance to be waylaid. Oh, didn't mean to click it. Whatever. Say, yet not without precedent. If you would know the truth of it. These incorrigible villains grow more organized with... Ah, Blanche said you are incorrigible. <laughs> I always say she's a cheap slut. This new unity of purpose we attribute to their leader, the Lady Iceheart. But though I have devoted significant resources to the task of identifying this woman, we have yet to learn so much as her birth name. Maple glazed cream filled donut sprinkled with real bacon bits. Yeah, that's that's the fucking ticket right there. We do know is that the heretics speak of ice heart in <sighs> reverent tones. Oh, hidden. And would gladly embrace death rather than betray her. Oh, you sweet summer Which child. Is rare indeed, and I fear to imagine what so committed a collective might achieve. The brigands have not yet been so brazen as to risk direct confrontation. I mean, fair, 
Fair. Some few of their number have, however, hold on, hold on. How basic bitch Western are you? It's PSL season. Are you in or are you out? That's what I want to know. That's the basic bitch o the basic bitchometer here. I've already had one. Huh? I've already had one. Well, you, yeah, you've already had one because you were also a basic bitch. A visit to White Brim Front may bring you the answers you seek. Will you brave the snows? No so then how can you be a basic bitch, Hidden? I just, yeah, this doesn't even taste like coffee. Hello, it only tastes Blackings like pumpkin pie in liquid form. So I take no pride in the Maple frosting. Oh. Are not so well yeah, yeah. I, I was picking up what you were putting down, Viv. I got you, buddy. I got you. You got Uggs. Mm. Come back to me when you have a PSL. I could not wish for a finer no to Uggs. You have done fucking Hidden's over, <laughs> Hidden's over here living in Seattle is like, I don't like coffee. It's like, sure, you're just like, er, there's but nothing so but, to, there but somehow. nothing but coffee to drink in Seattle, but you know. Should you learn art of value? It's like back in Spring Hill. There's nothing to do but go to Walmart. Yeah, because there's because they closed the fucking Golden Corral. And they opened four WalMarts. Oh, Jesus Christ! There's there's so many fucking WalMarts. Four Super WalMarts. Well, come on down here, Hidden. You come here, spend about six months, and tell me how much you fucking miss Seattle. I guarantee, goddamn, to you, Hidden. Four Walmarts within twenty five miles. I can find I can find four Walmarts within fucking five miles down here. Try me. <laughs> Wouldn't catch you dead down south. So then what the fuck do you like, Hidden? There there is no pleasing you. I don't like the north. Oh, what about the south? No, <laughs> I don't like that either. <laughs> Ice cream. Well, good. Then fucking move to Alaska. You can make ice cream in your back fucking yard. Seattle's on my my vacation wish list. Oh man! Like with uh, Chicago, San Diego, Denver. Man, Seattle! I fucking I love it. Jesus Christ! I love Seattle. Possibly uh, somewhere in Canada at some point. Uh, I mean, if you're going anywhere in Canada, I feel like you have to go to Ontario, specifically Hamilton, because, you know, like... <laughs> My favorite author lives there. <laughs> Your favorite author does indeed live there. <laughs> he's a... He's, he's a... He's a storied author of such businessy titles, such as Cryptocurrency and you, should your business invest in blockchain? <laughs> isn't, isn't that just a one word response? No, no, no. It's, it's, it's one word repeated over several pages and printed and bound. Hey, listen, listen, hold up, hold up. That. 200 and some odd pages, I think. It it doesn't have to be, like, sad sluts in, in sweaters. The sluts can be happy, you know. It can just be, like, hot girl summer, and then sluts in sweaters. It doesn't have to... They don't have to be sad sluts. I don't want the sluts to be sad. They should be happy. If you're a cold slut, then how is the sweater doing its job properly? That's also a good point. Then a cold slut in a sweater is... Are they really in a sweater at all? I mean... I'm... I'm not going to complain because... I know why you're not going to complain. Cold, cold, cold comes with some... I know why perks. you're not going to complain. We know. We, we some know. Perky perks. Oh, okay. uh, there it goes. There he is. Just... Talking about boobies, you see. Yep, you sure are, buddy. But I feel like if you're wearing a sweater and you're still cold, something's wrong. Because we're talking about fall weather here, not winter. Well, it so really, in Seattle, 
It's less about sweaters and more about like windbreakers. <gasps> spoopy season. Fucking love me some spoopy season. It's my favorite time of the year. You know, we were actually talking about this, and I'm I'm kind of of the opinion that I'm all right with Halloween starting to take over uh, more months ahead of October. Kind of like it's outrunning Christmas. Yeah. Like leave Thanksgiving for dead. Just leave it out. Hey, Who fuck cares? you. But, but I mean, just, just eat the food. It doesn't matter. It's fine. But like. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. It's gotta so, outrun Christmas. Okay. So here's Come the thing. Up with another holiday to eat food. We will fight. Eat we will fight over Thanksgiving, because, like, directly behind, and I mean directly behind, fucking, um, behind, uh, Halloween. It is my absolute favorite holiday. It, it's because I love Thoughttober. Ooh, I like that. I gotta tell Bean about that. Um, but like, I love to fucking cook. Bean keeps telling me more and more that I need to do a cooking stream. Which scares the absolute fucking bejesus out of me. I don't think you'd have to find a way to uh, get all of your streaming set up downstairs. Hidden, Slut September, you ha Slut Timber is right there. Like, you just, you just left it on the fucking table, Slut Timber. Like, she's not even trying. Like, mm. wow. Wow. Where did the lo where'd the love go? Wow. Apparently, it got left in fucking August. Hey, I don't like Halloween, so... I want Thanksgiving to start earlier. That's fine. Listen, you don't... You... I mean, okay, we'll, com part, we'll compromise. That's, that's more Halloween a lollipop than you. Ha Halloween can grab can grab uh, Thanksgiving by the wrist and drag it with it. But my point is, is that those holidays need to outrun Christmas because Christmas is already taking over most of November and it's creeping into October already. And so those those holidays need to take up more. Like it, it shouldn't be Christmas in July. It should be Halloween in July. You know? I gotta tell you, bud. Like. You. Okay. Tom is my best friend in the whole world. We all know this. Mm hmm. That's what he says right before he's about to say some shit about me. No, 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 nope, nope, but? nope, that's but? it, that's, that's the, that's the end of anything about Tom. I'm just, I'm level setting here. Tom is my best friend in the whole world. But buddy, let me tell you, you're high up on the list, okay? Like, you're, like, Tom, Tom, Tom maintains top spot at all times. As much as, you know, I want to shove a potato up his ass but you know lollipop Ooh. you're you're up there buddy you're up there um but let me tell you you are a terrible fucking guido you're just just really bad at it like you don't season your food and you don't like the one holiday dedicated to fucking eating like literally that's all it is is just eating that's that's the whole thing uh mm -hmm. and then and pretending to watch a football game so you don't have to talk to anyone. Also that, yes. Well, that's 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 like a uh, that's an introvert technique, but you know. Well, it is, but in the instance of Thanksgiving, you know, like I don't dislike my family. I don't have a problem speaking to them, right? Like, well, so I'm not really concerned about that. Except it's more except of a, senior. Oh, well, I mean he. You don't dislike Senior, he's just a pain in your ass and you don't want to deal with him at any given point. Right, but what I'm saying is the the technique is one for leave me alone so I can digest things and be in discomfort for a while. Sure. I'm full of potatoes and meat. That's fine. Um, so, Viv 1, I need, to I, I need to hear this story about how your dad killed Santa. 2... Uh, I am. I am also Wait. of the opinion that, like, like I'm. I'm not a Christmas person at all. Just at all. You sure aren't. Which is 
in stark contrast to my wife, who is very much a Christmas Your person. They say opposites attract. I guess. Fact, I guess the Paula so. Abdul sang about it. She did. It's true. Because it was her and someone <laughs> dressed like a cat. It was Peter Griffin. Yeah. Oh, that's who it was. Yes. Because <laughs> I'm just like a cat. And I suspect such frivolous wonderings do little justice to the reality of your travails. Tell me. Oh, the fat black chocobo flying music is just the greatest thing. I still haven't gotten the. I still haven't done that yet. And this transpired. Oh, so I went the cheap way, or not the cheap way. I went the expensive way, but the cheap way, like, effort was. You went to one channel, um, gift of the subs, and peace the fuck out until it gave you the thing. Yep. That that promotion's done though. Yeah, yeah, it was done like a few days ago, wasn't it? Uh, like last Monday, I think. Yeah, something like that. That she is capable of commanding such a band of fanatics. Oh boy, okay. Alright, this, this is... And no small measure of charisma. This is gonna be a hell of a story I can tell already. As much as I would like to fathom this mystery <laughs> with you, the situation has... Now, I, on the other hand, I, I knew Santa was a crock of bullshit from the beginning. Like, there was, there was never a point in my life where I believed in Santa. <laughs> you, you came out holding a sign boycotting him? <laughs> Hey, speaking of people who are obsessed with Christmas. Ah, and her face lit up. Like a Christmas tree. That. That's because she to hang up light nipples. Yeah, she does she does love hanging up light nipples, but we got Halloween light nipples too, you know. That's where the light that's nipples true. came from. No, that's, that's not the same. Yeah. That's different. The Halloween ones and the Christmas ones are not the same. Yes. Oh, okay. I just I didn't know if you kicked down the door for a reason or if you just kicked down the door just for just to kick down the door. Oh, okay. So just to kick down the door. Yeah. Oh, okay. We'll come here. <laughs> no. There's a bean. It was a bean. Bean. <laughs> oh, the most. She's a good bean. Excellent, excellent. Glad to see you upholding the, the vows that I signed the paper about. Yeah, 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 yeah. Tom I says good so job holding up them vows. To take appropriate action. Except the one about the uh, touching my butt. She's been she's been playing a little fast and loose with that one. Which yeah. which vows were they? A E I O or U? Those are vowels. Vowel 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 mm, mm -hmm. I get the I get those mixed up sometimes. No, it'll happen. Um. Oh, you forget! You forget your fucking wedding mm. vows. Get out. <laughs> Figure. She legally owns it. She's working on it. She doesn't legally own it. Get out. Then do I own the titties? <laughs> well, that's different, though. No. Yeah, I mean, it's different. Yeah. Yeah. Get out. Get out. Get out. Get, get out. <laughs> yeah, Viv titties. That's, that's all. That's it, Viv. That's, that's honestly, that's all you need to hear. That's... Uh... Yeah, no, he did, this always escalates. This is all this is always what happens. That <laughs> It's because it's because as he likes to say, boobies they make him smile, you see. Mm -hmm. yeah, get out. I ain't the only one. Get out. <laughs> okay. On the matter of the stolen provision. Well, there's the Ludley Pop button. The Ludley Pop? Alright, I, I got it. I got it. But he did. He did it twice. Do I, does he get two for that? For the price of one? <laughs> I probably I probably shouldn't since I'm trying to rack them up, and if all I have to do is put ASCII boobs in chat to get a loot, I can I can wreck that scoreboard. <laughs> I will put I will make it I will make it a banned term. Don't <laughs> Don't push it, buddy.
Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But yes, uh, I think I think the the moral of the story here is uh, titties. I'm pretty sure that's it. That's Ooh. the whole thing. Mm. Titty sprinkles. Yes, titty sprinkles. Correct. Mm, yep. Sprinkles. Also, yes. <gasps> Viva. Vivian K. S'mores. Okay. So. Just gonna tell us a story, everyone. <laughs> okay, this is gonna be good. This is gonna be good. Okay, I, I'm gonna, I'm, I'm turning game audio off for this one. This is gonna be good. Okay. Okay. So, the year is it's 2000. I had just turned seven years old, and my sister will corroborate. I can't say that word. Corroborate. Confirm this story. Uh, my sister will confirm this story with me. Um my father decided that he was just sick of doing Christmas. And he was like, I swear to God, I'm going to shoot Santa Claus. He says, I swear to God, I'm going to shoot Santa Claus. And like, my dad has guns in the house and stuff like that. And we knew this as kids, you know, we were very conscious about them. And um, we're sleeping Christmas Eve. And we hear a gunshot in the house. And me and my sister panic and we run out to the living room and my dad's standing in the living room with a handgun. And we're like, Dad, what the fuck is going on? <laughs> he shot around out of an open window, but he told us that he shot Santa. A thousand points to your dad for committing to the bit. But like negative 5,000 for shooting the gun in the house with fucking kids. <laughs> he was not a smart man. <laughs> he was not a smart man, but he knows what love is. Oh, and oh if, Jesus. Uh, should have gone all out on the bit and like shot the gun and then like let loose something that would have like oh my god something land on the roof and then like you go outside and you look and there's just like little little legs and red pants dangling off the roof like an elaborate rube goldbergian machine just to to commit to the bit that just to confirm the kill yeah just to confirm well, the kill yeah down, and he stuffs and mounts santa's head oh my fucking god so me and my sister go back to bed you went and, back to bed after that? Yeah, we just went back to bed. You know, <laughs> what, would it's you fine. when you have someone we, like we this all, that lives uh, in your house? <laughs> like you're you're used to these kind of fucking antics, I'm sure. <laughs> oh yeah, like he's in a better place now. He's he's with the Easter Bunny. <laughs> <laughs> My parents tried to do that one year where they um they they took. Like oh cotton, cotton balls and like spread them everywhere in the house, and like tried to play it off that the Easter Bunny had shed everywhere. Oh Jesus Christ! They even like got some stuck in the door and everything, and I was like, "Are you serious? Are you serious right now, Clark? <laughs> I'm not cleaning this up." <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> can I can I go hunt for my Easter egg money now? <laughs> oh my god. That is great. I told I, this story to some coworkers uh last year around Christmas time and they didn't believe me, so I had to message my sister and like get her to confirm the story for just me. Just be like, can you can you just confirm that, that dad actually fucking pulled this nonsense? Oh my god. Now, is your sister older or younger than you? Uh, she's four years older than I am. Oh, okay. All right. So then you then you definitely have a reliable source. Because when you're seven, she's 11. She can definitely confirm these things. That's incredible. And also, what the fuck? Speaking of the old man, how's his leg doing, by the way? Uh, as far as I know, he's doing okay. He's um, He's mobile and... He's he's not letting it keep him bedridden. Good, good. I mean, you know, he's he seems like the type that would bounce back pretty quickly. 
Yeah, he's already out hitting the bars again. <laughs> Listen, you know what? You got to do what you got to do. All right. Uh wow. I'm. I mean, I'm not even surprised. Like, <laughs> I'm. Not, I'm not even mad. That's amazing. <laughs> Hmm. Just sitting around like 15 years from now. Like, remember that time Dad killed Santa? Those were good times. Takes another fucking sip of eggnog. <sighs> oh, so I didn't quite finish the story. Oh, there's more. Okay. <laughs> Who else so did he shoot? So my, my sister and I thought he was joking, like, you know, okay, dad, really, whatever, you know. And we just went back to bed and everything was fine. That Christmas was relatively normal, I suppose. Aside from the fact that my father just fucking shot Santa Claus. Sure. So we thought he was joking until next year when there was a significant amount less presents under the tree and we we're like where were, where are all the presents and none of them were addressed from santa claus like extra committed to the bit oh my god he's playing the long game he's playing the none, long game none of the presents were addressed from santa claus and we were like where are all the presents from santa oh my god and we were like where are all the presents from santa claus and my dad, deadpan, goes, I shot him last year, don't you remember? <laughs> we were like, wait, really? Okay. So, is, is, is there more to this, or is that, is that basically it? That's, that's, the, that's, the gen, that, that's the end of it, yeah. So, first of all, one, commitment to the bit, just top-notch, top-tier. Two... Maybe not necessarily shooting, but some kind of similar something. That's a hundred percent something Tom would do. Um, like Tom would Tom would come up with some elaborate scheme to to point out that he killed Santa and then remind the kids next year that Santa is dead. No, to I uh, uh my kids wouldn't. I wouldn't have told them about Santa in the first place. Like. Like yeah, it's bullshit. Oh my god! So I put in I put in general yeah. chat a conversation I had with my sister confirming the story. Can I can I show this on? Can I show the screenshot? Absolutely. Okay. Absolutely. All right. So here here folks, here's the screenshot of the conversation between Viv and his sister. <laughs> Sammy, how old were we when Dad shot Santa? I believe you were about six or seven. So I was like nine or ten. Thank you. Anytime. <laughs> Uh, I was telling a co-worker the story and she didn't believe me. Well, there you have it. Our dad killed Santa. <laughs> just like, oh, just, you know what? Well, well, well fucking done. Well fucking done, dad. I'm, I'm, you know, I just, oh my God. All right. Hidden wants, Hidden wants to know. Hidden wants, I don't, th Hidden, I'm, I'm sure, I'm sure that she doesn't know. Because she's too uh, young are, for this story. We are not telling Mackenzie this story. We're, okay, yeah. <laughs> Just wait till she's in college. <laughs> like fucking, like, like fucking 20 years from now. She's got a fucking degree. It's like, by the way, grandpa killed Santa. <laughs> <laughs> Just thought you should know. <laughs> uh, yeah, no. Everything your entire life has just been me. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god. Just wow. Santa has been us this whole time. Oh. I, well, I thought you guys would appreciate that story. That's <laughs> fucking phenomenal. So. I'm I am I am thrilled and honored that you would share that with us, Viv, because that's just the fucking like the one that tracks for your dad, and two, that's hysterical. And also simultaneously ridiculously stupid. Oh my god. <laughs> Just sh sh fires one out the fucking window. Shot Santa. Really? Oh my god. <laughs> like, 
mean, it, to be it, it, to be perfectly honest, it, it's not the worst time someone has decided to shoot a gun at something. I think taking pot shots at Santa is way more logical than, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to shoot my gun at a hurricane. That's fucking fair. That's that's a very Florida thing to say. That's <laughs> well, that's because it's a very Florida thing that happens. <laughs> that's that's fucking fair right there. Every but that is a hurricane, they have to announce to people, hey, please don't shoot at it. Yeah. Yeah. And they do it anyway. I don't know what they expect is going to happen. Because people shoot at it, and then they have to announce it because people keep shooting at it. I mean, at this point, we should just expect... (laughs) We should just expect people to shoot at the hurricane. The hurricane is the government coming to take my guns. They took our germs. (laughs) Took our germs. Ooh, ooh, I have another conspiracy theory. Oh, God, here we go. This is going to be good. Hurricanes have a giant magnet in them. Oh, for fuck's sake. And when the hurricane rolls through, all of us that got our vaccinations are going to have the chip implanted on us. are going to get attracted to the giant magnet and we're going to get drug into the hurricane. Are you trying to win the yikes also? <sighs> I'm already winning the yikes at this point. Fuck it. Yeah, sure. Why not? Oh, my God. I'm. You know what? I'm not even dignifying that with a yikes. I would I'm, like to I'm submit. Only... I would like to submit that my Santa story deserves at least one yike. No, you know what? I, I, I'm going to give you the highest honor. I, because, uh, on, uh, because your dad's obviously not here to collect it. And I'm awarding you with the second ever big yikes because that is a big yikes thank you I'm honored yeah <laughs> should you be though <laughs> should you be no <laughs> the yikes count oh, yeah it's yikes counting oh my god so oh, Viv-, Viv and I are tied you're tied that's what you get for talking shit Uh, that's not a leaderboard you want to win. Nope. Nope. It's kind of like fucking... It's like it's like watching war games. The only winning move is not to play. Oh, God. You mean like the game you lost? Uh, I don't even know. Probably. No one knows it's half the fun. It's true. Zoop. Oh, my God. I just... Like, I'm still trying to process it in my head because everything that you told me both makes sense and makes no sense. So it's just... There's just... There's a lot of things. There's a lot of information processing through here right now. Like, it sounds like a skit from an old Saturday Night Live bit, doesn't it? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, or like Kids in the Hall or something. Yeah, yeah. Like, it can't be real, but I know it is. Oh, but it is. <laughs> it could have been like the movie Santa Claus, where he shot Santa Claus, Santa Claus is dead, so now he has to become Santa Claus, and then he uses that as an excuse to run away. Yeah, like, instead of falling off the roof because he scared him, he shot him, and then he just, like, collapsed. And suddenly, he's wearing it. <laughs> he gets to the North Pole, he's wearing the suit, it's like, why is there a, why is there a gunshot in the suit? Cool. Instead of uh, <laughs> instead of going to the uh, gas station to buy scratch offs, he shoots Santa. Goes off to the North Pole to take his place. I would have to think at this point, Santa suit has to be bulletproof, right? Like, I mean, I mean, if he's coming to my city, it has to be. That's a good point. I mean, if he's coming to Florida, it has to be. If he truly sees everything, right? Like, like the story says. Yeah, but it, like, it, if dep- he's... it depends entirely on if he asked for it for Christmas or not. Okay, but here's the thing, though. Like, who himself? Sure, yes. Why not? Yeah. Listen, he has to. If anybody knows how to treat themselves, it ought to be Santa. So here's my question, though: If he does see everything, 
then that ruins the entire premise of the Santa Claus, doesn't it? Because the whole point is, if he sees everything, he would have seen Scott Calvin coming out to scare him off of his the, his roof. So he would have seen it coming, but he didn't. So does he see everything? Or is that part of the big lie? Or is huh. it just for kids? Because when's, when's the last time Santa delivered a gift to an adult? He gave him, well, he... When you reach 18, do you just age out of that and his, the, the GPS tracker he tags you with just no longer functions? No, remember remember Neil, the psychiatrist that was like the ex-wife's new boyfriend the, the, that was going to be the stepdad that everybody hated? He gave him a weenie whistle at the end of the movie. <laughs> oh, I want one of those. Do they have... I mean like an Oscar Mayer one. That's a... You know what? Fuck you, Tom. That's a lewd for you. You get a lewd for that. And... Like, did he at least do it in private or? Private weenie whistle reporting for duty. <laughs> you said duty. <laughs> <laughs> I can get one on. I can get one on eBay right now for ten bucks, new in package. Do it. You fucking won't. Fuck, man. You might. They got a plush? I get a plush weenie. I could get a plush weenie mobile. Oh my god, it's the wiener mobile. It's the wiener mobile and it's plush and I need it. Fuck. With your strength now pledged. I'm gonna get a goddamn wiener mobile. You are beholden to no You stand as the vanguard for a united Aorzi. Huzzah! Wiener mobile, of course, the being the Famous car of the superhero Buttman. Jesus Christ. I literally cannot with you. Are you unable to even? I am unable to even. On a scale of one to even, I literally cannot. Well, with that, I'm going to love you and leave you guys. I love you too, Viv. I appreciate you stopping by and coming and tell us and regaling this with the story of how your father killed Santa. And um, ooh, 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 Viv, are you are you gonna subscribe to the uh, critically acclaimed MMO RPG from Square Enix, or are you sticking to the free trial that goes all the way up to level sixty and includes the award-winning Heavensward expansion? That might have to wait until payday this week. Mm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. He's he's delaying it up to payday this week. Okay, we're talking like he's he's putting it off by only four days. So, holy shit. My payday is tomorrow. Oh, you get paid at the end of the month? Mm-hmm. Nice. What a bunch of responsible... F the fuck you, Hidden. You have, like, seven jobs. Called me a responsible nerd. Uh, I would like to submit that uh, Zunder is still the adultiest adult. Goodbye. God damn it, <laughs> son of a bitch. Accuse and run. That is that is not not uh, the mark of an adulty adult. Wow. And after you... And wow. after you gave him a big yikes. This is why your dad shot Santa, Viv. <laughs> wow. This is, this is, that's, you want to know why? Do you want Santa to get shot? That's how Santa gets shot. You little ingrate. You fucking turd. God damn it. Just like fucking Santa. Uh, now I know how Santa feels. It's fucking it's like a fucking drive by in this neighborhood. Jesus Christ. Uh, I'm eager to see what the Crystal Braves might accomplish. This shall prove an interesting time indeed for the Scions. Jesus Christ, what the fuck? Yes, I'm listening. So our worst fears are confirmed. It's the a green chicken. Isle. A green chicken? Power defies comprehension. Yeah. A, You've done this quest line. A chocobo? No. No, it's a literal green chicken. He's still doing Hildebrand. Oh, oh, that. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. It feels like I've been doing it for my entire life. And will continue doing it until the day I die. Yes. 
I shall pass on. That sounds Hildebrand about right. Yeah. Is if it, if you're not having fun with Hildebrand, it is on the list of things where you can very comfortably just skip all of the cutscenes on it. I shall contact you. Oh, you yeah. it'll it'll be a one giant fetch quest if you do that. When I land but the loss of the Isle of I don't Val, I just I, not hope that my I want whatever the blue thing is Yet, at the end. By some miracle, it would seem she has. Um, to regain consciousness, it is true, because I must have all of the blue things. You do like blue stuff. You've it made it most of the way you through Stormblood, right? Sense of the readings taken by no, the no, no, no. Okay, because... Barely. Barely started it. His story does run all the way through Stormblood. Is of a magnitude alarmingly close to so, like, you're doing a Realm Reborn stuff right now? Be responsible for this devastation as well? It will oh, eventually I conclude. Think. It'll pick back up Wonder. in Heaven's Ward. Have you heard art from and I can show you where it picks Garland. back up in Heaven's Ward. Oh my and god, they actually call it the Mother Crystal. It's 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 Crystal Mommy. One of us. Silence portends not but ill, I fear. Sorry. No, 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 you're good. It's, it's, I'm just rambling. Oh, this calls for a flying chair. Mm -hmm. I pray you yet watch over us. Louis Soir. Mm, nothing like a double cutscene. That's how you know shit's about to get real. <clears throat> That's a unicorn on that shield. It's one of them there horses with the little... Right here. It's the technical term. Don't worry about it, it's fine. Mm. That's a castle. How will I know when I'm about to go to the Heavensward stuff? Will I know, or will it just kind of happen? The the game spares no expense to let you know that you are about to start Heaven's Board. Okay, fair enough. I, I can guarantee you that. Hey, look, there's an old guy in a chair. <clears throat> He's got a fancy... Is, his, is this the Pope? Hey, is that a Pope hat? And... It's the pope -ato. No, Those are Lollifel, you see. Not lollipops? No. Oh. I am not a pope -ato. I'm a cat girl. You are. It's true. Mm -hmm. Hey, look! Isn't that? Uh, isn't that? Yeah, those are those assholes. And there's a, there's the Pope. No, 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 no Assians. Oh, Assholians. Cornholio. Not inaccurate. I feel like I'm. A new chapter of New Game Plus has been what? I think it's I think it's getting to the part where they're sparing no expense. What what is the name of your current quest? Um, I don't know. I'm in a cutscene with with Peach. That's a weird perspective, or else she looks small. That <laughs> desk is just ginormous. That desk is it too is big. It is large and in charge. <laughs> well, I mean, I'm in, I'm at the Crystal Braves part, so. Down, 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 down. What the fuck? My current quest is Traitor in the Midst. You...
I got a new chapter of New Game Plus, so you know that seems fancy to me. You did, you did finish patch content. You finished two point three. You've still got some to go. Damn it! So I'm like, I'm in like pre Heavensward stuff now. I'm like post patch, but pre Heavensward. Correct. You're you're the um. I'm like pro. You're still doing it. the. You're still doing the hey, patch content of Realm Reborn. How might we serve you? Damn it! Seriously, this is like the longest trek of MSQ Commander that they have. This, so like this entire. The gap between finishing a Realm Reborn and starting Heaven's Ward is over a hundred quests. It might be less than that. I don't remember if. That is the area that they cut back some of the quests on. Jesus Christ. They don't do this later, do they? Not to this extent. There is always sub patch content, but Yeah, but not like it is not like an entire expansion's worth. Correct. A Realm Reborn has a lot of just padding in general in it. I tell you and strictest confidence. When they only have ten levels to work with as opposed to fifty, even in like the sub patch content yeah they some days ago we they have a lot less to story they that they need to tell the because they don't have to fill as much in that's that's fair viv you motherfucker following some discreet inquiries we identified a suspect among the immortal flames whom we detained for questioning Alas, the man was That's very adulty language agent. you just used. He was but one of many men in Fuck you. Employ. <laughs> Sounds like something the adultiest adult would say. <laughs> Quit stealing monkeys. <laughs> Fuck you. Fair enough. <laughs> <clears throat> we pressed the traitor for a name, but he had none to give. He claims never to have met his master, whom he knows only as the Ivy. The Ivy sounds like a douchebag. He was, <clears throat> however, certain that this Ivy had coiled itself around every part of the immortal flames. Well, it would then that wouldn't that just burn? The company some time ago, and gradually recruited others to his cause. These conspirators are the vines by which he learns our secrets, all without exposing himself. It won't be easy to identify the ivy amidst this tangled mass of subterfuge. But we have a tendril in our hands, and we shall follow it all the way to the gnarled root. Boy, you really know how to beat a metaphor into the ground, don't you? <laughs> now, much as I would prefer to proceed with due discretion, circumstances demand that this matter be settled post-haste. Post-haste, Anon. Post-haste. I know what post haste means. War of it means after end. haste. And it is yes, it means <laughs> quickly now. This cat girl's name is Warm Coffee. Not Bacon Bits? No, that's a different cat girl. Ah, I see. I want to I wanna see a cat girl named Meow Mix. That's all I want. I would ask that you accompany me to the Hall of Flames and remain on hand to see that things go smoothly. Assuming the ivy's tendrils are as characters, as we characters, he may door. He may against us. Games. We must yeah, mix. While taking care not to betray our purposes by seeming prepared, a simple enough task for a one-woman army like you. I'm expecting some of these to be Lalafell just because uh, people like to name Lalafell after food. Oh, that's, yeah. There's a uh, crust. Meow Mix. That person's name is After Hours Meow Mix. Cat girl, cat girl, cat girl, cat girl. Cat boy, cat boy, 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 small boy. Peas, small amount of peas. Uh, girl boy, see this girl red boy. fire truck's all red and everything. Big cat meow mix is a Hrothgar. 
No, that's that's different. Candice Meow Mix is part of a free company called Cat Cat Girl Communism. I mean, that's that sounds like. Yeah, I'm I'm about it. And this cat girl's name is Cat Sandra Meow Mix. Oh, that's that's pretty good. I'm I gotta I gotta admit that one's pretty all right. Uh, this Lollafell's name is Chibi Meow Mix. Oh, that makes sense though. Damn it! Now I want to watch Sailor Moon. Choco Bro <clears throat> Meow Mix. I got B to start watching the original manga of Sailor Moon. She read some of it and then determined that manga wasn't really a format for her, which is understandable. But she does want to watch it now because she thinks the story is cute. Is Does having to read right to left offend her? No, it's just like she prefers to read with words well, as opposed to sparse words and a shit ton of, of, um, of illustration around it. See, I lack imagination, so I need those pictures. That's yeah. fair. Oh yeah, that would be that would that would have been perfect, Viv. Honestly, like just hello, guy. She is here at my behest. Greetings, Roban. It has been a while. Hilbert, you old scoundrel. You old scoundrel. Visiting, I scarce believed my ears. Gallywag. Do they have a secret handshake? Are they going to make out? You, the honored captain of the crystal bloody braves. Who'd have imagined, eh? Not me. Mail chap. But fewer still Cheerio. would imagine your Pip -pip. destiny lay in politics, old friend. Yes. Aye. We've both come far, have we not? You would lose your shit if they just started making out right now. I would have been. I would have. There'd be like. Ooh, 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 ooh. A lot of rivals since we Oh, yeah, obviously. Look at them. They both fuck. Look at them. The last oh, they fucking. Al amigo had just fallen, so you can guess how many summers it's been. And in all that time, not a word from the fool. Ah, well, my dealings tended toward the modest and mundane, unlike some I could mention. As I hear it, no sooner did you reach Thanaland than the brass blades clapped you in irons and dragged you off to die on the blood sands. Turkey. Hi, Nick. You I, a thousand matches I don't have a turkey command a yet. In the people's hearts while you were about it. I need to make the, uh, I need to make a turkey command at some point. Then, with your mountain of prize money, you bought the Colosseum and secured a seat on the Syndicate. Those balls, brother. Balls. He said balls. Do it justice. You're a hero to the common man. Yeah. Pa. And and I mean, look at his fucking hair too. That's some that's some that's some quality braid he's got going on there. Next to her, I'm little more than a glorified butcher. Would you, Wilbert? Oh, Butcher, you know what sounds good right now? Fucking steak. God, I haven't had steak in days. Fuck, I want a steak. In minutes. In minutes. Minutes. I have also not had steak in days. No, you've had you've not had steak in day. Not in this company. Anyway. I guess it has been two now, hasn't it? I have tidings. So there has been progress. trying to prepare for a post tropical depression. Any recommendations? Um, bottled water, batteries. Um, that's most of it. Honestly, that's and canned food. Bottled water, mm -hmm. batteries, canned food, like ready to eat canned food. You can just twist open fucking can opener and eat it. Those are my suggestions. We actually have an emergency stove with, little, with little propane tanks. Oh, yeah. nice. Nice. We've got those, and we've got these um, inflatable dams so we can like put them by our front door in case flooding ever gets that bad. Yeah, that's, yeah. I can't, I, Viv, I can't do SpaghettiOs. It's the sauce. 
the sauce is like weirdly sweet. It's like there's something wrong with the, the sauce and the SpaghettiOs. Now, Chef Boyardee, Chef fucking Boyardee, I will go ham on like fucking 73 cans of beef ravioli. Oh, there you go. The camping stove. That helps. Yep, yep, yep. Just be careful because it is, you know, it is a fuel source, a compressed fuel source. But yeah, the bottled water, the canned food, the batteries, that's, those are the big ones. And that's not just like, like your double A's, your C's and D's for like bigger things like flashlights and shit. I'm talking about getting like a USB power bank. Make sure those are charged up for your phone and shit too, so that you're able to communicate with people if you need to. These and these, these nuts. Get out. <laughs> we actually got these, um, they're power banks, but they have like these giant like floodlights on them. We must needs consider a far graver they're they're meant to kind of just be stored outdoors i know what you're talking about though i've seen those yeah, yeah. they're fucking good the i always charging have a... in the uh in the garage right now yeah i i viv i always have one that i keep charged that's down in the kitchen just in case very well we have a um have my most trusted men investigate just uh oh, i remember shelf. that one viv Your inquiries in the meantime you have just the what? We, we have a shelf that is well just, um, again, I've got two week, power strips, um, mounted to the back of it. And it's just for charging things. We've got all of our controller chargers on it. We've got like phone chargers on it. We've got headphone chargers on it. Um, we have, I want to say five or six different power banks because we acquired so many of them when we started playing Pokemon Go. And then we we're like, oh yeah, for hurricanes, this is probably a good idea to just have them. And we bought a few more for, um, the garage to keep charged out there. We have a bunch of uh battery powered fans so if you the power goes out we can friend. keep cool <laughs> I must work hard if I'm to keep up. our general plan is if we if we keep um if the well, power goes out for a long period of time we will kind of scatter in the house yeah, just to so kind of keep cool and proof. keep a fan on us <laughs> yeah just so you're not like building up heat and all in one spot mm -hmm. uh nick they they do have generators on most of the cell towers too keep in mind because a lot of them they have to because they're maintaining critical infrastructure for emergency responders. So like two days they might they might have battery for two days for the transmitters, but they're also gonna have um, generators on most of those too. Seventh heaven. Get the fuck out of here with that shit. Oh, wait. He's over here. Some of them do, Nick. Some of them don't. Not all of them use first net. This is getting intense. This is intense like music. <laughs> this is scary music.
This sounds like a like something bad in 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 Zelda. Yeah, no, Nick, he he beat you to it, bud. Yeah, that, conver that conversation was so like 10, 20 seconds ago. Oh yeah, oh that was like. <laughs> Alex, I need you to come back to the office. What? I quit there like fucking weeks ago. How baked are you right now? Ooh. Who is this? Is this Marv Albert? <laughs> I'm way too baked to drive to the devil's house. Look at all this crystal shit. That shit is indeed crystal. Mm-hmm. I just love that there's crystals everywhere and people are like, yeah, this is fucking normal. What's your point? Mm. It's not much they can really do about it. I mean, I guess that's fair, yeah. Alright, a rescue mission. Does this mean that... Okay. Yeah. Be careful, Nick. Aid. Aid by putting your hand on him a lot. Yeah, just aid. Hold on. Whoa. whoa, whoa. <laughs> just give him the old give him the old There you go. <laughs> I haven't used the Wololo button in months. But now you gotta wait a few more months to use it again so that you can say it again. I know, right? Or you can use it tomorrow if you forget that you used it today. That's true. announces Sleepy Kirby Necklace in Japan. Is that so? <laughs> Sleepy Kirby sounds adorable. I mean, Sarah any Kirby sounds adorable. What about playing real Kirby? Sure. Adorably shitty. Adorably shitty. Shittily adorable. Just fill in a five gallon bucket. Oh, yeah. Sir, I don't believe you have a pet out. I did. It was out. And... Oh, it was, was it? It was. Listen. Listen what, here's okay. What had happened was. Hey, get out of here! You're not. You're not one of them fucking instance mobs. Get the fuck out! Put your face. Go on. Get now. Varmint. Oh, God.
I will say it is nice not to, like immediately dying from shit like this now. <laughs> like it's almost like I it's almost like I can do this. Almost. Bro, I am not in the fucking mood. You either get the get. Little piss ant, get the fuck out of here. Can't deal with this shit. to get my Pokedex out. Yeah, well, you end up getting, like, high item level gear, especially when you're, like... Because the gear you've got is probably going to take you most of the way through Heaven's Word. Oh, good. There's more assholes. Also, I think Venus cackling again, which means she's on the TikToks. I love it when they're on the TikToks. You, my friend, have a nice day. I love that I can just kind of come and go into the Imperial Stronghold whenever I please. Just like, nope, I'm gonna eat the fuck out of here, and there ain't shit that you can do about it. <laughs> Say, what are they gonna do? Fly up after you? Fuck no. They don't have flying. You have flying. <laughs> I'll just beat their asses like I did, you know, several missions or quests ago. Fine. Whatever. Yeah. Meh, Meh, meh. You dirty rat, you killed my brother. Mm. I'm gonna punch you in your buttocks. Something bit me. Lieutenant Dan got no legs. Lieutenant Dan, you got new legs. <laughs> Lieutenant Dan, ice cream. Yep, she's still cackling. What is she even watching? That's so funny. I don't know. She's she's just she's on she's discovered shit post TikTok. I thought that was all that site was. Well, sometimes it's bear talk. Yeah, someone sometimes. has someone has been has been stuck on bear talk for days now. Haven't you, bud? Didn't I di didn't I send you another bear related thing like yesterday? I don't Whenever know. Whenever I see a bear thing on my TikTok, it, I, I send it to you. Yeah. Usually it's cats being adorable. Or someone being like self depreciating for the sake of memes or some shit like that. What? I don't know any idiot that would do that. Nah. Mm -hmm. Some fucking dildo would probably do that for the content. Ah. <laughs> uh. Oh, well, that is a perfect place to log out. <laughs> I 
having nice. fun with your with your uh whatever the hell that kid's name is Hildebrand. Oh no, I abandoned him. I was. I'll get back to that later, and or never. No, but there was, I was about to start an instance for the story. I was like, I don't want to. There's only four minutes of stream left. I'm tired. I don't feel like it. Yes, but do you yeah. have do you have a thank you card signed by by Bubba and Wedge? Oh, oh, that is adorable. Yeah. She sent me a picture of that, and I had to not say anything. I know. I I figured she had. Yes. And I was like, well, you've killed them both. Oh, yeah. No. You're happy with yourself. So Bean has the ornament at work, and I kept the card here on my desk. I have the ornament hanging in, uh, it's in, hanging in the living room. Nice. Oh, don't worry, Viv. As soon as I'm done here, that's the first thing I'm going to go in there and do. Is she going to be okay knowing that Santa's dead? Yeah, we'll we'll get her counseling. It'll be fine. Hmm. Is she going to be okay knowing that he was murdered? Tell her like, it was a mall Santa. She'll be fine. Yeah, right. Don't tempt me, Viv. I will absolutely. I kind of have a genuine curiosity as to where that bullet ended up, because that that shit comes back down no matter what. Like it, it goes lands somewhere. Well, maybe he like he pointed it out the window and shot it down into the ground, you know, to prevent any you know complications. Mm. Like you shoot it in the ground, it hits the ground. It's you know the. The ground absorbs the, the, the impact. It's done. It's fine. Right, but the implications of that ah. is that the Earth is Santa. Oh, well, yeah, okay. So he lived in the backwoods, so then the nobody was around. Also, random shots are being fired all the time there. That kind of makes sense with how... Uh just meh Viv seemed to be at the fact that there was a gunshot yeah it was commonplace and also again I think he was used to his father pulling you know stunts like that at home okay so yeah pretty sure it was into the ground which that makes sense that makes sense Well, I got a feeling within the next few quests, I'm going to have a new area of the map that I can explore. Ah, uh, I see, Viv. I see. I see. Umbreon is scheduled to be here on Thursday. Oh, yeah? Mm -hmm. Do you have the excites? I am very excited. Yeah. I mean, we live in Florida, so we have to play gunshot or firework on a weekly basis. Mm -hmm. It's the best during it, holidays it, where fireworks are involved. And if you would like to play that game at home, all you have to do is download next door. <laughs> <laughs> it's true. It's true. Wow. We're forming alliances and shit, y'all. Mm -hmm. Look at all these alliances.
Where, where is the guard? Is the guard outside? Guard, are you outside? Mm. He's a doorman over there, I believe. Oh, there he is. Yeah, he's totally right there. Oh no, I can't finish this right now. I can't do that because I have that's that's it. That's gonna be stuff. Oh god. So you actually had to work for Thanksgiving. Ooh. Yep, it is about that time. It is about that time. Which means we are gonna call it a night. Mm-hmm. 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 That's it. We're done. We're done. Um, oh, yes. Oh, yeah. Um, let's see. Sold, sold out turkeys. We did a lot of chopping and plucking. Yeah. Yeah, I bet you did, bud. Bet you did. Ooh. Uh, oh, God. Fresh eggs. Fuck, yeah. And fresh chicken eggs last for fucking ever. It's amazing. Um, all right, so let's see. We got we got a lot accomplished. I feel like. I mean, I feel like I trudged through a bunch of stuff. We did. Mm -hmm. I I got to see Yoshi P. You know, our Lord and Savior. Um, yeah, I guess it's not a it's not a big uh, event, but it it's a meaningful one. Yeah. I, I it's, dig not, it. it's not every event that the uh, you know the director of the company pops in and is just like, "Hey, thanks for playing my game. You're a good guy." <laughs> it's like watching. It's like when you were a kid and you were in Sears and they had the Super Nintendo set up, and you start playing for like five minutes and then it resets. It's like, "It's a me, a Mario. Thank you for playing my game. Bye bye." Here, have an mm -hmm. umbrella. Yeah, here, have an umbrella. <laughs> have an umbrella. Um. Yeah, that's about it. Um. Okay, so. Beat that for scrambled eggs. Damn it, Viv. <sighs> Go to bed, Vivian. Um, Alright, so Wednesday's group therapy night. Uh, Friday, we're back playing the fork knife with the, the llama back there. Um, let's see. Next Sunday, um, or I guess this coming Sunday, uh, playing Dragon Quest XI. That was the you pick game for this coming week uh, that Elena redeemed on behalf of Matt Calder. Uh, once again, if you are not... Let's see. Let's see if I can do this. If you're not following Matt, uh, Matt's working on his uh, fundraiser right now for To Write Love on Her Arms, a fantastic organization uh, that helps find support for people who are struggling with depression, um, suicidal thoughts. Um... Whoa! Tom, you picked a game. It did the thing. Did you hear it do the thing? It did do the thing. It did the thing. Sorry, oh. that was bad timing, but it did the thing. No, that was good. I like that. I like that. Um, so, um, but yeah, Matt's raising money right now for To Write Love on Her Arms. Um, he's streaming basically every day for the next couple of weeks. Um, he's got a couple of bonus streams uh, where his wife is going to be doing some crafting stuff. And she's just an amazing, wonderful human being. They're both great. Um, but if you get a chance to follow Matt's stream, you really should. Um, I'll, I'm thinking about it, Viv. I'm thinking about it. Just, I'm thinking about it. Um, I gotta, I gotta figure out logistics for all that. Cause that's going to be, that's going to be like a, an all day thing one Saturday or some shit. Um, but anyway, so yeah, um, Matt's got some goals for their, um, fundraiser, including playing Fortnite with me, so, you know, if you can, go give them money so that I can force Matt to play Fortnite. And this is just for you. Anyway, um, that's about it. Um, did I miss anything, fellas? Uh, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, smash the notification bell, uh, follow Matt so that you can uh, make him play Fortnite so that you can do that creepy face for Hidden again. And after over a year of trying, I'm finally going to get you to play Hades. Yes. It doesn't hurt, hurt that it's free. I mean, it looks like a fantastic game after watching you and others play it. But, yeah. 
It's just the goddamn best. Yeah. It's best in the genre. It's it's I mean it's full of sarcasm, oh, which sorry. you know I'm about. I'm I'm surprised you didn't try to make him go play with his knifeu again. I mean I don't know. We had our fun. I I don't know. I mean I'm sure we'll come back to that at some point. I have to romance the 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 dagger or whatever. Alright, fuck it. Who's 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 playing? Um Tate's playing Portal, the Xbox Ambassadors channel's live, Oceanity's playing Majora's Mask Randomizer again, Strom's playing Minecraft. Um, I love you, Vivian. Go get all the rest. You've had a very, very big, busy, tiring day, and you need the sleepy sleeps. Go do it. Um, I don't know, what do you guys think? You rated Tay last time. Right? Yeah. Was Tay last night? No. No, was fire, fire was, was last night. night. Uh, Tay was Friday. Tay was Friday. Oceanity was, was last Monday, I believe. Yeah. No, last Monday or last Wednesday, I don't remember. Yeah. Um. So, uh, dealer's choice. You know what? Let's let's raid the Xbox Ambassadors channel. With for 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 something a little different. Um, no, I I believe that channel is family friendly, so you know, be on your best behavior when you get there. What do you guys think? Oh, here's some ideas. Okay, why don't I pick none of those? He said dealer's choice. I know it's still funny. Well, fuck you. All right, we're gonna we're gonna go see the Xbox Ambassadors channel. Um, uh, again, let's you know, all the all the good stuff, all the respectfuls and everything like that, but. Um, We'll, I love your faces. Thank y'all for being here. I appreciate it. We'll see you uh, Wednesday night for group therapy night, most likely, unless some shit goes down. I don't know. I'm, I'm keeping my ear to the ground for some stuff. We'll, we'll talk about it at some point. Anyway, um, that's about it. All right, y'all be good to each other. See you Wednesday. Bye.